Ok, add the cube in edit mode, press M to merge vertices together. Now press E to extrude the vertices and define the shape of your pipe. Press A to select all of your vertices, press Ctrl B and V to bevel your vertices, something like this. Okay, then in object mode, right click and then convert to curve. In the bevel section, increase your depth. You can increase your resolution, but for a low poly model, 6 is okay. Okay, then right click and convert to mesh. Now you can select these edges and press Ctrl B to bevel and select two segments with the mouse wheel button. Then extrude your faces along the normal. To avoid the weight shading, you can right click, then auto smooth. In edit mode, select center edges and bevel one segment very thin to something like this. Okay. Extrude faces along the walls in the inside. And rename your low poly model. Okay, now select these edges with Alt Shift click. Don't forget the inside edges. Got a lot of nice videos on YouTube on how to unwrap ping cylinder. Then Shift Alt left click on the last edge, right click and mark UV sim like this. Ctrl A, scale, to apply a scale in object mode, press A in edit mode, U and unwrap. Ok, now we've got our UV map, so you can add the material with a UV checker to check if your unwrapping is ok. You can rectify some weird island UV to get more space, select them with L, press UV and rectify. Then select all of your UV island with A, click on a red scale iron and pack iron. You can use an add-on like uh, UV pack master to help you to pack your UV island. Okay, so now I got my nice low poly model wrapped, so I'm gonna to duplicate him to create a high poly model. I rename it high poly, then I select him, I adding a bevel modifier with something like uh, three segments, subdivision modifier. So okay, I got my eye poly model and I'm gonna to hide my eye poly. I'm gonna to export if bx my low poly. So I choose visible object, mesh, geometry I choose face and I export. Same for the eye poly. I uh, hide my low poly, export if bx visible objects, mesh, face, and I export. Okay, now in Simpson Peter, I'm gonna create a new project. I'm gonna select my low poly model and open. Okay, I got my model. I have my UV map, so I'm gonna in texture set setting, back mesh maps. I choose 2K texture resolution. I open my eye poly model and I click on bake. 
Now you have an infinity of texturing possibilities available to you depending on the rendering you want. You can use generators with metal edge to add more detail to your model. You can easily get renders like this one or this one. If you guys want a tutorial on the texturing of these famous pipes, do not hesitate to tell me in comments. See you soon guys!